Hey everyone, uh, Tiram here. Uh, today I just want to do a quick video uh, before the Fan Fest this weekend, just kind of going over my thoughts and uh, predictions on what I'd like to uh, see this upcoming weekend during the Fan Fest uh, keynote, as well as maybe some other things that we'll see. Um, nothing going to be too crazy this time around, no crazy uh, predictions or anything, because I don't really think there's really much we can do in regards to making a prediction uh, on a lot of things. I think we kind of already expect or have an idea of what we're going to expect uh, with this upcoming uh, fan fest, uh, well, at least with the keynote. Um, so I think more it's going to be just kind of like things I just want to see, see them maybe like clarify and whatnot. So let's get started. Uh, so three things I think that we can expect or guarantee that we will see at least this weekend um, is going to be uh, the release date. Uh, I think the release date is going to be uh, announced after they show the full trailer, which is my second uh, thing that I think they will show. Um, I think what we will see is my prediction for the release date is going to be the end of September, last week of September, uh, first week in October. Um, that's my hope anyway. I, I don't really wish, I wish it, we'll hope it won't be that much farther than that date, but we will see um, with everything going on, it's really hard to tell right now. Um, but yeah, and then also I think we will also get the, the full trailer. I think the trailer will be announced, will be released as like the opening like they did last time. We will just see the entire trailer, um, and that's really fun. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they uh, take what we've seen before, add the little bits that we probably don't see, and just kind of go from there. Um, things we can maybe extrapolate um, or maybe predict but happen in the story. You know, all the juicy details it'll be fun to kind of pick at later on. Uh, the last thing I think we're guaranteed to see is obviously I think the new job. Uh, whatever that melee DPS job is, we will definitely see it. Um, and I'm looking forward to seeing what that is because I think as all of us saw with anybody else who made prediction videos last time, it did not go well for us. Uh, a lot of us were completely off and wrong, so except for saying that there was going to be a healer, but no one predicted the healer to be the sage uh, in the way that it is. So I'm excited to see what they what they come out to showcase. I guess if I'm going to make any stab at it for one last time, uh, I think uh, a scythe wielding class is de is one that I would say that would be necessarily a good bet. But that's probably the best bet I'm going to get. Maybe a hammer uh, is the backup, just in case. Uh, and I guess if I throw a name out there, I'll throw Scythe. Uh, I'll, I'll throw uh, Reaper and Templar. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, the last one didn't go so well, but, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. Um, so I think those are things that we can guarantee that we will see, is, is those three things. Uh, some things I do want them to kind of elaborate on uh with the upcoming well things that we heard previously is one i want to hear uh changes on on the healer uh, i know we got the healer the sage last time we kind of we were told that they were going to double down on barrier and, and a uh, pure healers uh, i kind of wanted them to explain a little bit more on why they went that down that path uh because originally the reason why they didn't do one in shadowbringers was because they wanted more time to kind of see what they wanted to do with the healers um, but the fact that now they've kind of just taken this information and doubled down on, hey, this is what we're going to do. I'm curious, uh, you know, what their thought process is on that, why they went that route um, and what they plan on doing for, for healers. Are they going to be are the, are the healers just going to continue with what they do now? They have their normal AOE heals, regular heals. Um, do they have like their DPS is the same Is it just a, a damage a pure single target damage and AOE damage and a dot you know I want to see like are they just gonna keep the same or are they going to you know maybe change things around a little bit so hopefully get maybe some information there I don't think we will get it this weekend because I think they will save that for the media tour when they actually show uh, showcase the um, the the job trailer because I'm thinking we're getting the job trailer this weekend as much as I'd love to see it I just don't think they're we're there just yet. Um, will I be surprised if we get it and be excited? Absolutely, I would love to see it, but I just don't think we're there. Um, but uh, we'll have to wait and see. The other thing I do want to see is I want to see some information regarding the summoner rework. Uh, again, this kind of may go back into the we have to wait to the media tour where they actually show off more job job specific information. But I, you know, one can hope that they'll maybe say something about uh, summoner rework. I read an interview that uh, Yoshibi mentioned something about uh, Summoner Glamour and uh, he mentioned that the Summoners were in a state where they were kind of at a tipping point and just hearing that little like message there kind of made me want to think that they actually are considering an actual rework so I feel like if anything we, we maybe get something small like saying hey we are planning on doing something for the Summoners it's going to be a little bit of this you know maybe give us some 
small details, but we'll have to uh, to wait and see. Uh, I, I do plan on wanting to do a full dive on Summoner um, and actually posting what I would like to see them do, especially if we get some any information. That's definitely something I'd love to make a video on and what I would personally like to see for the class uh, going forward. Uh, the other thing I would like to see them uh, show away of is the new zones. I want to see more information on said new zones. Uh, I know they've done like a like a trailer in the past where they've kind of walked through like the zones or at least like flew through them real quickly and like you just kind of saw things as you flew by. Uh, I don't know if we'll get that just yet, but you know some more screenshots will be kind of nice. I just on some place some of the places we're going to go and visit in the expansion. Uh, the other thing I also want to see is the the trial, the new trial that we're going to be doing uh, this upcoming uh, expansion for the 24 man raid. I would like to see. Uh, at least a name for it. I guess I'll throw out a prediction of maybe Silver Chair Lake, since it's something that they mentioned was deep in mystery for a long time. Uh, that's definitely been deep in mystery for a long time. Uh, so I would like to see that, but hey, anything. Um, just happy to, to hear what, what they have to announce. Um, and, the, and I think that's pretty much it. I don't think I have anything else that I have that would I would like to talk about. Oh, Island Sanctuaries, yes. Island Sanctuaries is something I do want to see uh, them and talk about. Uh, give us a little bit more on how the gameplay is going to be. Uh, give us a little bit more on what we expect, how things are going to shake up for that. Just any information we can get is, is good. Uh, but that's pretty much all I have. Uh, super quick video. Uh, I am going to be streaming the Fan Fest, uh, the keynote event for the Fan Fest uh, on Twitch. If you'd like to hang out, I'll put my Twitch link in the description below. And uh, we will uh, hang out, see what we got, see what we see, and just enjoy the, the content. Um, that being said, I need to go ahead and head off for get some food and to prepare for a raid for tonight for more uh, UCOB. So I will see everybody uh, either on my stream or in the next video. Until then, take care.